Hi everyone and welcome to today's video. Um, a few weeks ago I had Comic Con and one of the days I cosplayed as Liv Moy from iZombie. So I thought that since Halloween is coming up and there's always different Comic Cons going on, I would share with you um, what I did for my cosplay in case you want to dress up as Liv Moy um, to kind of give you ideas. When I was deciding what to do for my cosplay, I watched a lot of YouTube videos on other people doing a little more cosplay and I found it helpful so I decided to make one as well in case it helps somebody else. Okay so to start off with I just went into my closet and found some stuff that reminded me of what Liv Moore would wear so she wears a lot of hoodies especially she, she has like a maroon hoodie or like navy blue or something like purpley blue colors normally work well for a cosplay for her um, so I have this maroon hoodie that I put on, and I wore it, I don't know if you can see, hold on. I wore it with, um, just this dress that I had in my closet. Um, it's got, like, some florally print on it, and dark colored, and then just some navy blue leggings. And so that's what I used for, like, the base of my costume. I also added my brown... Um, combat boots, I think is what they're called, to it, just because she wears boots like this a lot. Hers are normally black, but I didn't have black, I only had brown, so I did those. Um, and then to add to it, I put on a lab coat that I had just laying around the house. Um, my older sister had lab, a bunch of lab coats from when she was in nursing school. And so we had a lot left over, so I just threw one on top, and that was kind of my Live More cosplay. Um, I also added, because she has like really pale blonde hair, um, I went online on Amazon and just got a pale blonde wig. I was going to cut it since her hair is a lot shorter, but I decided to just leave it longer because then I can use it for other cosplays, and maybe one day I'll end up cutting it. Um, and then I pinned some one side back because she does have a side of her hair pinned back. Um, in newer episodes it looks like she has both sides kind of pinned back, but I think one side it's just like the curl is curled back a little more. Um, so I did that. Now on to the makeup that I did for it. Okay, so since Liv Moore is a zombie and she's pretty pale, um, I got some white face paint since it's close to Halloween time. They had a lot of this in the stores. Um, I got this for only like a dollar and I helped, I mixed it in with my foundation and put it on just to make it a little bit more pale. Um, so I did that and started with that. And then since she has like red rims around her eyes because she's a zombie, I got a just, I went with more of like a burgundy-ish color, but you could do a more bright red. I got a lip liner, and I just put that on like eyeliner, just to give it more of a red look. And then I used a makeup brush and kind of like spread it out. And I did that a couple of times in between different layers of makeup that I did, just to give it a more reddish look to my eyes. Um, I also put on just a regular black eyeliner around my eyes along with that and then I got um, just some eyeshadow and did the matte colors that are like dark so dark matte colors and put that around my eyes to help them look more sleep deprived um, and zombie-ish I don't really know how to explain it but I added that as well and with um, my eyebrows since if you have light eyebrows her eyebrows are kind of dark so you could just add like something to make your eyebrows darker fill them in a little bit more okay okay so I will kind of do a time lapse of me putting on the makeup just so you can see how it's done I am most definitely not a makeup person and really have no clue as to what I'm doing so yeah oh, oh. yeah Okay, 
and that's pretty much my Live More cosplay that I did. Um, I forgot to add that you should probably put this on first before you do your eye makeup, just so it doesn't get in the way. Um, I did mix it with like my foundation that I use, um, and then I did put some more on top when I did the original cosplay today. I just had my normal makeup on. And then just added this on a little too late because I forgot to do it before I started with the eye makeup. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I hope that it was helpful to you if you want to do this cosplay. And I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching and have a wonderful day. Bye!